Hi everyone, so in this video what I want to talk about is reducing the power your fears have over you. So recently I was working with a client and they were talking about all the exciting things that are happening in their life, you know, there's a lot of movement and change that's going on. But then after that they started talking about all the fears and worries they have about these same like changes that are happening. So what we started looking at is what is it about these situations that are coming up that are turning excitement into fear? And what I want to talk about is reducing the power your fears have over you. So the first step to doing this is to write them down. So a lot of times when we're holding fear in our mind, you know, we're scared of this or we've got lots of worries, we've got lots of anxieties. Writing them down brings them to life. And I know that, that feels like counterintuitive because if you're worried and fear, fearful about something, you don't want to write it down. But you're doing that because you're making it real. So you're writing down, OK, my fear is that I won't have enough money to live off. My fear is that if I leave my job, I'm not going to find another job. So you write down the fears. Then what we did in the session is we looked at, are those fears realistic? Then the second part to it was, what is the third part? is how could, what can we do to combat those fears? So what action can you put in place? And it was so powerful. I've never done this exercise before with a client because I just it just came up. So a lot of times with me as a counsellor, and that's what, in a way, I'm really impressed with myself. I'm just going to say it about sometimes I'll be working with a client and out of nowhere, just based on what they're saying, I'll come up with an exercise right in the session or afterwards I'll say, do you know what, this is something, and I'll create a specific session and I created this because I thought this person so anxious so many worries so many fears so as we were going through the list of the fears one by one we were combating them we were saying okay well if the worst happens what would you then do and she was saying oh well I would do this and I would do this and then we said well there you go then your fears that you have you've got a plan if you do, if those things do happen. So the key thing is to reduce the power your fears have over you by writing them down, asking yourself, are they realistic? Then making a list of, you almost put an action next to each fear. So this is the fear I have. So what's the um, action that I can take to combat that fear? And then what, what happens is it reduces the power that it has over you because you've already decided that, you know what? No matter what happens coming up, I've got a plan anyway. So if that fear does come to light, I've got a plan. In the meanwhile, you can get excited instead about those plans and you can relax because you know that no matter what happens, you've got something to combat it. So let me know what you guys think. Does that sound like a good idea to you? Leave your comments, share this with others and thanks for watching.